I'm here with Ric Flair and the ninth one of the world. How are you guys? What's going on, con man cosplay? You are looking at the diamond ring wearing, Rolex wearing, wheeling dealing, kiss stealing, son of a gun. Woo! China, do you have any catchphrases you want to throw in there? There's no catchphrases that I need as the ninth wonder of the world. You are looking at China. She is the baddest woman in wrestling history, the ninth wonder of the world. Like it or not, you better learn to love it because it's the best thing going right now. You want to get ready to go to the top of Space Mountain? It's the oldest ride with the longest line. Woo! I don't even need to say anything. This guy's a promo machine. I'm looking around and I see a bunch of groups. I see 501st, I see Avengers, I see Justice League, but I don't need none of that because they can't hold a candle to Arn Anderson, Ole Anderson, and Tully Blanchard, the four horsemen. Woo! I, I don't know, I'm blown away. This is all promos. This is just like too awesome to even think of actual questions. Okay. To be the man, you gotta beat the man. And I'm the man, 16 times world's champion, Nature Boy. And that's how the Geek Gatsby cosplays. Woo! Let's see, just pretend I'm like me and Gene Okerlund. All right, I got you, I got you. Okay, um, all right, both of you share a bit of history with uh, Shawn Michaels. If you were here today, what would you say to him or how would you feel about him? I'll tell you, Mean Gene, if the heartbreak kid Shawn Michaels, Texas Finest, was here right now. You know what I'd tell him? You should be a member of the Four Horsemen, because you did it right. You did it with flair. You did it with panache. You owned that walk down. You owned that ring on the same limited amount of actual wrestling moves as I did. That sweet chin music was something else, but he had charisma. He had flair. Oh. Yeah, talk about you want to talk about my Shawn Michaels, my member of DX, my man's best friend? Seriously? I'll tell you what I think of Shawn Michaels. He may be the pretty boy. He may be the Mr. Main Event. But I'll tell you right now, I'm the woman of the main event. I'm the only woman in all of WCW history, WWE history, WWF history, without being in the Hall of Fame, that tombstone The Undertaker. I put a guitar over Billy Gunn Badass's head, and I will, and I mean this, Sean, I will take my belt back. You know, I'm gonna say something on that. Are you listening, Vince McMahon, WWE whatever? You listen up, because China belongs in the Hall of Fame. You wanna keep her out because she went and did a thing, but you've got the Von Erichs in there, you've got the Ultimate Warrior in there, and don't tell me that that history isn't tainted. You were naming a main event after the fabulous Moolah. Are you kidding me? China went and did a little adult filming, and you keeping her out of the Hall of Fame. Vince McMahon, you should be ashamed of yourself. You go sit in the corner with your Cheeto-looking man, Donald Trump, as two of the most ignorant men in the United States. Get China in the World Wrestling Hall of Fame. Woo! And who are you, Triple H, to tell me I can't be in the Hall of Fame? Cheating on me for a year with your slut wife? Are you serious? A year? And you expect me not to stay at the WWE? That's okay, because in the adult film industry, I had bigger and much better men than you. Anytime you are talking to the Geek Gatsby, nerds like us, the baddest party thrower, in all of nerddom, you will get quality entertainment like this. We only deal with the best. Woo!